just putting some more spokes. This is going to be a rear wheel with the offset. So what I do is just make up a simple gauge out of a piece of wire, just so that I can make sure I've got the right spacing on the hub. Just flip that over. Another one for the back. Just so I can see that it's in line as I'm picking the spokes in. Um, sometimes you get some distortion, so you need to remove a spoke. Six spokes in. This is another front wheel, just starting the spoking. Got one front and one rear. So these are basically similar widths, just different offsets. So that's the front, and that's the rear. showing you the difference in offset between the front and the rear wheels. This is uh, next stage, putting the axle in. Uh, so rear axle will be supported on a couple of these. Um, pillow blocks, I think they're called. Uh, these are cast aluminium with a, a bearing in it which can allow for a certain amount of misalignment. Uh, so I've turned up some 10 mil threaded uh, cylinders just so that I can weld to the chassis somewhere around there. Some bracing. So we've got the windscreen aperture on. It needs to come forward on this uh, lower rail. It doesn't protrude far enough. These stays here are just temporary to hold it in place, just so I can gauge it. Uh, at this stage, it looks a bit ridiculous, and the wheels look too small. But normally, what we'll do is start with a model such as this one, and then measure the wheel and tyre uh, overall diameter, and then use that as a scale. For example, the, the wheels are half the height of the body, so it's very easy to upscale to the actual model that I'm making. Uh, and the wheels in scale they should be about 16 inch uh, and the actual car runs 15 inch wheels so they're slightly too big but bigger wheels are quite easily uh, disguised on the model. See there the different offsets for the front and the rear. I'll start making some bullet spinners to hold them on. Three head spinners. That's about it on this one. This is a few hours later. So I finalised the shape of the window, front windscreen, added some stays to hold it in place started on the centre console and I build that up a bit more to make it a bit more structural and the rear axles in or mounts are in and some bracing just to keep it all in the right place. One more wheel to make, the front and the rear 
said earlier, the rears are deeper dish. And the fronts. Right, so for now.